Here we're looking at a 2010 Max Force DT failed EGR cooler. It was uh, indicated in the uh, oil sample. Critical level coolant in the oil, but the giveaway was uh, coolant was blown out the surge tank caps, 15 psi, and we put a gauge on the uh, cooling system. It was getting up to 25. So the cap, of course, isn't going to hold her in, so it's blowing out. And there's the baby there. I'm guessing about 60 pounds. The biggest EGR cooler in the medium duty industry. It's got to be. More EGR, eh? more emissions. So it comes with uh, a pull the turbo. And possibly the manifold if you really want to make it easy, but more work. But uh, yeah, the kit comes with the uh, cooler. It's nice uh, to throw in the seals and gaskets, studs, cap screws. So we're going to pull the wheel, the fender, air filter housing, everything. Just got to clear it right out of the way to get at this thing because it's. Uh, once you're into it, there's no turning back. So onward and upward, it's no good, bust down. Gonna change the oil when we're done, the contaminated oil. And uh, pitter patter.